Okay, the first flying machine. So, got my paramotors. We've done some tests on the thrust to prove that they can lift something. Next thing I'm gonna do is the chassis. Now, I have had a thought in that both of my propellers are gonna be turning in the same direction, which will probably give some gyroscopic spin. Because if you think of a Chinook, they have two propellers and they run in opposite directions. So, I'm gonna have to flip one of the motors up on its back, which means this chassis going straight is probably not gonna do. I'm gonna make like a little S-shaped one so it goes under the back motor and up over the top motor. So that's what we're gonna start with. A little S-shaped frame. This is the last, so I tell you, my friend It's all unwritten, but we came to this end It's sad, it's true, but it's nothing you can do But accept that your world is blue Moments in life, minutes you fade, fade Will always be mistakes, nothing right you made You gave head to the corner in the hall of shame That be the place where you reach your fame With a human as a leader on the top of the chain They want to keep you as a dreamer and cost you the pain Protect the veins, don't let them rain There is no way back once you are going you have to break safe walls to build up new And be proud if you even get the right to be you Got yourself through, there's a heaven on the other side With the world so wide where you can forever ride Restless only one Right, that's kind of got me a little uh, S-shaped frame all sorted Look, lovely jubbly Now I just need to sort something for me to stand on to Like some foot pegs And then obviously some handlebars So I'm going to put my feet on this little bar well, I think that wants to sit roughly in the centre of the frame, obviously, because I want to be the central mass on all this, which is about 1.2 metres. And if we get some tubes, up here, we put them down on the frame, off there, basically at right angles, and then another one going up there to brace it. Excellent. Spit your words for everything that is evil. There is always something worse. Or the first you do not deserve to be observed. As I got them curses, you can never reverse what you did, what you done. But control what you do. Turn your back on them, and they will be a future for you. There is hope. S-shaped chassis, all done. It's quite light as well at the moment, which is a good thing. Next job, add the motors, and then start adding some controls, fuel tank, little bits and bobs like that. Yep, it's all going well, I'd say. So, we've got a rear engine, we've got a front engine. Now, I've left the paramotor frames on because these things are pretty well made. They're CNC machined, I can't make such a good a job. So I thought, what's the point in recreating something which is already good? Now, I can't have the rear frame on because it'd be underneath the engine, a little bit pointless. So, I've got to get that rear engine frame and mount it above here because obviously when I'm stood here, I'm gonna have a propeller whipping around behind me and I don't wanna fall back and get me. And then the age old internet question of will it blend will be answered. So that's the next job. Mount the frame above the rear one and kind of give us a little bit of a symmetrical look, even though it's all wibbly upside down and back to front. Woo! Don't look at me, can't stand your eyes. Why can't you see my words are lies? Don't look at me, can't stand your eyes. Okay, got three things left to do. Fuel, electrics, and throttle. What have I made? My words are lies. Don't look at me. You can't stand your eyes.
unlearn everything I know about mobility. I have made a machine on your request. You want something that flies? I've built something with no wheels, no steering, no brakes. It's got two accelerators. It doesn't even have a seat. But of course, the big question is, is it going to work? The next video, of course, will answer all that. Will it go off the ground? Will it fly? Will it take my weight? Will it be controllable? All of these things need answering. They need answering, Colin. Answer them for me.